Welcome back to my channel Gurugul. If you are watching my video for the first time then please subscribe my channel and click the bell icon for all notification. Today I am going to start with part 3 of exercise 7.3. Question number 8. A shopkeeper buys a dinner set for Rs 1200 and marks it 80% above the cost price. Alright. So, cost price ho gaya 1200 or is pay profit hua 80% right. So, we need to find the first part of question number 8 is the mark price. So, 80% of the cost price right. So, mark price kya ho ga? Mark price will be cost price plus 80% of cost price clear dono ko add karenge tabhi to hoga hamara mark price to ye kya ho jayega 1200 plus ab yahan pe isko solve karte hain zero isko cancel kiye so 12 8 za is 96 aur wo remaining zero to hamara amount kya aaya mark price ka rupees 2160 so we got the mark price Alright, now the second part of question number 8. Bola gaya hai, we need to find the selling price. Alright, selling price if he gives a discount of 15% on it. So, ab yaha pe discount ho gaya 15%. So, formula or mark price to hai hi hamara. Mark price is 2160. So, formula kya hai, wahi hai. SP is equal to bracket 1 minus 15 by 100 bracket closed into the marked price. Clear? So, ye hamara ho jayega. After taking out the LCM, it will be 85 by 100 into 2160. So, 0 and 0 got cancelled. 2, 5s are 2108. 1, 0, 8, 5, 1, 5, 1, 7, 17. So, 17 into 108 gives us the amount of rupees 1836. So, ye hamara selling price nikal gaya. Now, the third part of question number 8. Pucha gaya hai, we need to find his profit percent. So, profit percent kya hai, ye find out karna hai, right? So, yaha pe CP was rupees 1200, SP nikla hamara 1836, therefore profit is SP minus CP that gives us 1836 minus 1200 is equal to the amount of 636, right? Ab hum logo ko profit percent hai. So, 636 by the cost price, which is 1200 into 100. 0, 0 kar gaya. Ab isko hum log reduce karte hai. 6, 2s are 12, 6, 1s are 0, 6, 6s are. 2, 1s are. 2, 5 and 3. So, profit percent jo hamara nikla, that is 53%. And this is the answer. Question number 9. The cost price of an article is rupees 1600. So, CP is equal to rupees 1600, which is 20% below the marked price, right? So, if the article is sold at the discount of 16%, we need to find first is the mark price. So, part 1 of sum number 9, cost price tha 1600, jo ki hai 20% below the mark price. Alright, so if the article is sold at the discount of 16%, we need to find the mark price. So, let the Mark price BX or yaha bola gaya hai that the cost price 
of the article is 20% below the marked price. So, therefore, cost price is equal to marked price minus 20% of marked price. ये जो है 1600 वो ये अमाउंट हम लोगों को कैसे मिला? This amount is 20% below the marked price, right? तो हमारा ये equation form हुआ. So CP के जगह हम लोग क्या लिखेंगे? 1600 is equal to marked price है x minus 20% of x. अब इसको हम लोग solve करते हैं, right? Zero 0, 2 1s are, 2 5s are. So, 1600 is equal to x minus x by 5. We can also write like this, x minus x by 5 is equal to 1600. Yeah, LCM we will write 5x minus x by 5 is equal to 1600. So, 4x by 5 is equal to 1600. So, x is equal to 1600 into 5 by 4. 4 ones are, 4 fours are 16 and 0. So, x is equal to rupees 2000. So, we have solved the first part of question number 9. Now, we will move on to the second part of question number 9, jo ki bola gaya hai that if the article is sold at the discount of 16%, then we need to find the selling price. So, yaha pe mark price kya hai, jo ki abhi hum log find out ki hai, that is rupees 2000, us pe kitna discount diya gaya, discount was 16%. So, ab chaliye hum log SP find out karte hai. So, SP find out karne ka wahi hamara formula hai. SP is equal to 1 minus 16 by 100 into MP, which is the mark price, right? So, LCM nikalne ke baad and after subtraction we got 84 by 100 into 2000, right? So, SP is equal to 84 by 100 into 2000 equal number of zeros cut gaya so 84 into 20 gives us the amount of rupees 1680 so ye hai hamara selling price that means we have solved the second part of question number 9 now the third part of question number 9 hum logo ko find out karna hai profit percentage right so yaha hamara cp kya tha cp was rupees 1600 sp hum log kya nikale the sp was rupees 1680 so we can easily see ki yaha pe profit hua hai therefore profit is equal to sp minus cp which is 1680 minus 1600 that gives us the amount of rupees 80, right? Ab iska percentage nikalna hai, so profit percentage is equal to profit by the cost price which is 1600 into 100. Equal number of zeros kar gaya, 8, 1, 8, 2, 2, 1 and 2, 5. So, the profit percentage is 5%. So, yaha hamara question number 9 complete hua. And it's a request to all my viewers that please don't forget to like my videos. Question number 10. A shopkeeper allows 20% discount on his goods and still earns the profit of 20%. So, if an article is sold for rupees 360, we need to find the marked price. Alright, so selling price bola gaya hai rupees 360 and we need to find the marked price jab discount ho raha hai 
परसेंट सो यहाँ फॉर्मूला वही एस वाला है एस पी इज इक्वल टू ब्रैकेट वन माइनस ट्वेंटी बाय हंड्रेड इन टू एम पी और राइट एस पी इज थ्री सिक्स जीरो इज इक्वल टू एट्टी बाय हंड्रेड ऑफ एम पी जैसा कि मैंने पहले भी आपको बताया है कि जो भी अननोन हो उसको हमेशा लेफ्ट हैंड साइड में रखिए इसीलिए इसको हम लोग यू इस तरह से लिखेंगे एट्टी बाय हंड्रेड इन टू एम पी इज इक्वल टू थ्री सिक्स जीरो कॉटेड सो एम पी इज इक्वल टू थ्री सिक्स जीरो इन टू ये क्रॉस मल्टीप्लीकेशन हो जाएगा हंड्रेड बाय एट्टी सो जीरो जीरो कट गया फोर टू जीरो आफ्टर मल्टीप्लाइंग नाइनटी इंटू फाइव वी गॉट द अमाउंट फॉर अ मार्क प्राइज विच इज रुपीज फोर हंड्रेड एंड फिफ्टी राइट सो दिस वॉज द फर्स्ट पार्ट ऑफ क्वेश्चन नंबर टेन जहां की हम लोगों को मार्क प्राइज फाइंड आउट करना था Now we will move on to the second part, जो कि बोला गया है we need to find the cost price now. All right? So second part, the cost price. अब इसको समझने के लिए let me read the question again. यहाँ बोला गया है that the shopkeeper allows twenty percent discount on his good, जिसको कि उसने बेचा था three hundred and sixty में, लेकिन discount देने के बाद भी he earned a profit of twenty percent. Right? तो इन दैट केस हम लोग इसको कैसे सॉल्व करेंगे ये देखिए तो जब कॉस्ट प्राइस फाइंड आउट करना है तो वी विल डू इज लेट द कॉस्ट प्राइस बी एक्स और राइट और इसके ऊपर प्रॉफिट उन्होंने किया था ट्वेंटी परसेंट राइट लेट मी रिपीट जब कॉस्ट प्राइस एक्स था द शॉपकीपर मेड अ प्रॉफिट ऑफ ट्वेंटी परसेंट वो अमाउंट आया था सेलिंग प्राइस जो कि हुआ था रुपीज थ्री हंड्रेड एंड सिक्सटी सो इन ऑर्डर टू फाइंड द कॉस्ट प्राइस उसको हम लोग एक्स ले लेते हैं और बोला गया था कि उसपे उसने ट्वेंटी परसेंट का प्रॉफिट किया था और सेलिंग प्राइस हुआ था थ्री हंड्रेड एंड सिक्सटी राइट तो अब हम लोग इसको फाइंड आउट करते हैं फॉर्मुलर वही एस पी वाला है एस पी इज इक्वल टू वन सिंस प्रॉफिट है तो प्लस हो गया प्लस ट्वेंटी सीपी जो कि है एक्स सो एस पी इज इक्वल टू हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेंटी बाय हंड्रेड एक्स और राइट इसको यू भी लिख सकते हैं हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेंटी बाय हंड्रेड एक्स इज इक्वल टू थ्री हंड्रेड एंड सिक्सटी जो कि एस पी का अमाउंट है राइट सो एक्स इज इक्वल टू थ्री हंड्रेड एंड सिक्सटी इन टू हंड्रेड By hundred and twenty, zero, zero, twelve ones are twelve threes are thirty six. So x, which is our cost price, is equal to rupees three hundred, and this is the answer.